Hi, Marcos. Uh, 18 in a row, I suppose the, the team's very happy. Oh, definitely. Um, you know, we've been playing good basketball, you know, and uh, we're starting to figure it out as a group. I think, you know, just seeing how each other plays and, you know, what Coach just wants us to do. Um, we're executing and um, working hard. So, um, you know, it's been a great couple weeks for us and we're just looking to continue to get better. In your opinion, what is the key of, of the team in the last matches? Um, I think, you know, just, just our fight, our competitive spirit. Um, you know, I think we've been in a lot of games, you know, um, with how we played, but I think sometimes, you know, um, our attention to detail and then, um, you know, our will to fight at the end of games sometimes, you know, just wasn't there. But I think in the past couple of weeks, we've really um, taken hold of that and we've really been fighting, you know, and um, whether we're up or down, um, we're doing our best to really, you know, um, play the brand of basketball that coach wants us to play, and that's always the fight. In your opinion, do you think that the team changed the mentality of intensity of, of, of be better in defense? I think that's definitely um, our biggest point of emphasis. You know, I think, you know, when we handle our business defensively, I think, you know, um, that's the reason why we win big games. Um, a lot of the games that we've won by a lot of points have been games where we've played, you know, really well on the defensive end. So for us, it's going to be um, pivotal, you know, continuing to go on with the season is that, you know, our defense is at a high level. You dropped 19 points against FS, 15 against Fenerbahce, 29. Against Can you get any better? <laughs> um, Dev, I, mean, I think each and every game, you know, I can get better and better. But um, you know, it comes from you know what the game's presenting and you know um, the flow of the game and how we're playing as a team. And um, some games call for different things from me. And you know, uh, my teammates, you know, adjust, you know, uh, to whatever the game calls for. Um, that's what you know our team. It's one of our strengths. Are you know, if someone, you know, it's their night, you know. Um, we all we all adjust to you know how the game's flowing. So, um, but all these wins that we've had, you know, have been team wins, and it's been because a lot of guys have stepped up in a lot of different areas. Um, you know, that's what's great about our team. We're so versatile. We have a lot of guys that can get a lot of things done. So, um, that's what you know we've all attributed these wins to is just you know being together as a team and um, really playing off of each other's strengths. Do you expect to add as soon to the league, to the city, to the team? I'm sorry, he's repeat that. Yeah, yeah. Do you expect it to adapt uh, to the to the competition, to the league, to the, to the um, city? Yeah, it's been you know it's been a, a process. You know, it hasn't been you know an easy one, but you know each and every day has been a learning experience, and you know everyone's welcomed me with open arms, and it's been a great experience so far. You know, just being able to learn in a different style of play, um, be in a different city, um, meet different kinds of people. Um, it's been it's been a good transition for myself. You know, just to be. In a different place, and you know, experiencing new things. Marcus, Marcus, you are one of the most favorite player of the fans. What do you think? I'm fortunate. You know, um, I love our fans, and you know, they they give us you know a lot of energy each and every night, and they support us when through wins or losses. So, um, you know, I just want to be be sure I'm representing this city as well as this organization in the best way I can. You know, so um, I'm very fortunate. You know, I, I love the fans and. Um, they're a big reason why you know we're able to call this place a home. How do you feel on Sunday when all the crowd uh, says MVP, MVP to you? <laughs> you know, I mean, it's 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 definitely flattering, but you know, it's a it's a team game, and you know, I just want to focus on the team winning and um, whatever I can do to help the team win. You know, it's what I'm going to do, and you know, for the fans, you know, to give us so much energy and give us a boost in that game to you know come back from a deficit and be able to win. In our home, in our home court, you know, it was huge. You know, the fans played a huge part in that win. So, um, you know, I, I I hear everything they say. You know, I mean, they're they're screaming, yelling, having lots of energy throughout the game. So, I mean, um, I just love their energy. You know, I think us as a team, we feed off of that for sure. How many uh, three impossible shots do you train during the practice? Um, practice, honestly, Tell the truth. honestly, pra practices are very tough just because you know. We've been practicing against each other for so long that, you know, um, a lot of my teammates as well, they, uh, they know how we play. Like, everyone knows how each other plays. So um, it's tough sometimes, you know, to kind of do what you want as a player um, against, you know, your teammates. But, uh, you know, we challenge each other all the time in practice. And I think, you know, a big reason why, um, you know, we're playing really good basketball is because we're really competing in practice. And, um, you know, I, I leave the trick shots in practice to Rokas. Rokas, Rokas makes all the trick shots in practice. Uh, can you improve uh, still? Uh, you and, and the team. I'm sorry. Um, uh, can you uh, improve? Uh, uh, oh, of course. You know, yeah. I think you I, and the team. Uh. For sure. I think you know, there's still 
lots of room for improvement for all of us. You know, um, you know, our team, you know, we can improve a lot of areas, and I think um, we're going to be tested a lot continually this year. Um, there's so many great teams you still have to compete against, and myself, you know, each and every day, like I said before, is, you know, a different learning experience for me. Um, so I just take it a game at a time, practice at a time, and I know there's always room for improvement, myself as well as our team. What do you expect for our next game against Mitchell's Bologna? A competitive game. You know, I mean, each and every game in the Euro League as well as in ACB has been competitive. So um, just going into the game aggressive, you know, not only personally, but as a team, you know, we have to throw the first punch and, you know, we have to be the aggressor, you know, being being at home, but also, you know, wanting to be sure that we're keeping this winning streak alive. Mm -hmm. We saw that uh, box and one defense from Escariolo to stop Lorenzo Brown. Mm -hmm. Do you expect something similar mm -hmm. Thursday? I mean, I, I'm ready for anything. I mean, honestly, I, I've seen you know, every defense you could see, you know, from the time I was in college, you know, until now. So um, whatever teams, you know, have planned, you know, whatever the game calls for, you know, I'm going to do whatever I can to help, help my team win.